Now Mahomes gives it to Pacheco. 15-yard picked up there. First down, KC. Over the last couple years, Mike, we've seen the trend in the NFL is that third down has really become a passing down, but not here. Not for this team. They keep the ball on the ground. They're able to pick up a big gain. Fresh set of downs. Here's Patrick. He'll throw it on first down. He'll get rid of it and complete it. Certainly not the biggest play of the day, but a good example of picking up positive yardage, staying ahead of the chains by a well-timed ball and a well-timed route. Here's a handoff to Pacheco. He is met and dropped. Good defense. Loss of a couple on that play. Third and short. Here's Patrick. That's going to be incomplete. And it'll leave just enough time for one final play in this opening quarter. Ah, early big play here. They're going to go for it on fourth down. Now Mahomes. He's got his man. He finds Worthy. Here's first and ten. to Pacheco. Yeah. Oh, oh. And the Chiefs have got a first and goal. He's out of bounds at the four-yard line. shotgun it's Mahomes he's got his man middle of the end zone Travis Kelsey touchdown KC Butker's extra point is good and the Chiefs will take a 7-0 lead so now it's Butker following the touchdown to send this one away This one will be taken in the end zone. No run back forthcoming. And the ball coming out to the 30-yard line. Throwing now. Allen here on first down. He's got that complete to Knox. And he's brought down after a gain of six on first down. the gun. Here's Allen. That's brought in by the tight end, Knox. And that's going to be a first down. A pickup of nine. Nothing a quarterback loves more, Mike, than being able to pick up a first down without being forced to push the ball downfield and force it past the line to gain. He settles for the underneath check down. He's confident that his receiver is going to pick up the rest after the catch. They'll run straight ahead with Cook. And he surges forward for a gain of about five. Receiver in motion, headed left. From the shotgun, it's Allen. And that's going to be incomplete. Coverage was good that time. The contact jarring the ball loose and forcing third down. From the gun, Gajel. And that is incomplete. James Cook, the intended target. And it's going to be fourth down. 
Well, we sit up here all the time and we try to break down why certain plays work or don't work. Well, this one's not real tricky. I mean, he just simply needs to catch the ball. I mean, that close to the first down chain, he just catches that ball and turns up field. They extend this drive. He's got to come over to the sideline, take a deep breath, tell his guys, hey, man, that's on me. And he's got to go out and make that next play because his team's going to need him to play better as the rest of this game continues. That's taken in. And he's going to have the Bills first down as they find a way to convert on fourth and six. Well, you can see the entire sideline and, frankly, the entire fan base kind of holding their breath. That decision on your own side of midfield to go for it on fourth down, had they not gotten it, it's a tough position to put your defense in, but that's a conversation for another day. The offense is going to stay on the field after the conversion, and now they got to see, can they take advantage of that aggressive play call and finish this drive with points? Two minutes remaining. First half in a 7-0 game. We'll return to Arrowhead after this. Here's second and nine. Allen will throw. They'll set up the screen to Cook. Screen works to perfection. Give him 18 yards and move the chains. First down. Every once in a while, it just comes down to you need somebody in the huddle to just make a play. And it wasn't a whole lot fancy here. The quarterback just dumps the ball down, a quick underneath completion. And then really, it's the yards after catch that did the rest. And that's what it takes. You're not always going to have the perfect play. You're not always going to dial up the perfect play against the perfect look. Sometimes players need to make plays, and that was a good one there. Well, let's give some credit to the big boys up front in the trenches. They knew that blitz was coming. They held up just long enough that the quarterback could get that ball out safely and results in a completion. Here's Allen to throw. And that's going to be incomplete. Coverage was good that time. The contact jarring the ball loose and forcing third down. They've been a little up and down in this first half. I mean, they have less than 80 yards of total offense and halftime loom. So missed throws like that, those are missed opportunities. They've got to hit the plays when they have them if they want to have a chance to leave here with a win. Down inside the 10. And the Bills are going to be looking at a first and goal. He's out of bounds at the three-yard line. That's a gain of 14 and a first down. A chance here to draw level before the break. It's first and goal. Here's Cook. A ah, good blocking, and he's in. James Cook, touchdown Buffalo. And this is what good offenses in the NFL do, Mike. It's the ability to bounce back, even if the onset of the game doesn't go exactly according to plan. Everybody wants to take their opening possession and go down there and come away with a touchdown. But it's not always going to be perfect. You turn it over on possession one. What are you going to do in response on possession two? Well, we just got our answer, and they took it down for six. Following the touchdown, Bass is back to kick it off. And this one is fielded in the end zone. Will not be returned. So it'll come out to the 30. So they come to the line for first down and 10. They'll start on the ground with Pacheco. The hole closes quickly. He'll pick up about three. They face second down and seven. It's a pickup of three. Brings up second and seven. Out of the gun, here's Mahomes. He'll swing one out wide to Pacheco. 18 yards on the catch and run will move the chains. 
this is why most teams might decide to take the ball first after the halftime break because they want to be able to control this middle four. At the end of the first half, you can use your timeouts. You can use some strategy to steal an extra possession. If they're able now to go down and come away with points, they'll have a chance to double it up again right after the halftime break. Second down and three. Throwing is Mahomes. He's going to take a shot down the field. And this one is pulled in. What a grab. And he will score. Isaiah Pacheco. Touchdown, Chiefs. The kick is good. However, there is a penalty flag down. The defense might have gotten a head start. They didn't leave much time on the clock to put together a drive here at the end of the first half. And the kickoff's coming their way. This one is fielded in the end zone, but he will not bring it out. It's a touchback, and this drive will begin at the 30-yard line. On first down, it's Allen. Going to send it downfield toward Knox. Gonna take this one all the way. 70 yards. Touchdown, Buffalo. Well, that is a quick drive and the best way to finish it. The touchdown pass downfield. Greg, you rarely see a deep shot like that to start a drive. You're right, Mike. We don't see it a lot, but I wish we did. It's actually the most efficient and safest down to pass the ball. And in this case, the defense is thinking run, got a lot of defenders up in the box, and they're able to strike deep with a pass play for six. They didn't leave much time on the clock to put together a drive here at the end of the first half. And the kickoff's coming their way. But dangerous Miko Hardman on the return. And he's down at the 23, and that's where the offense will take over. First and 10. And they're just going to run it here up the middle. Nice job finding the seam. Gain of about nine. Just a yard short of that first down. A good spot here. Second and a yard. They'll keep it on the ground here again. And he will have the first down. Not a huge run, but enough to move the chains. So we've reached halftime here at Arrowhead with the Chiefs on top. As we'll send you down to Orlando now for Jonathan Coachman as our EA Sports halftime report. Coach, thanks. This one's still anyone's game. We'll see if we can come out with the hot hand in this second half. About to get started. Hardman now to return it. And he'll be taken down right at the 29-yard line. On the ground to start the drive with Pacheco. A gain of four as he's taken down. He's taken down at the 33 yard line. Here's second and six. They put Kelsey in motion. And he just does get that one away. He was being chased down, forced the awkward throw. Maybe he's fortunate that all it is is an incompletion. A rare miss for a quarterback that we've seen really come out on fire throughout this entire contest. I mean, his completion percentage, Mike, is well above league average. And frankly, it's really the biggest reason why they find themselves out in front. 
On third down, Mahomes. He manages to get the throw away and completes it. Mahomes finding Rice for the Kansas City first down. These crossing concepts are frequently used, Mike, throughout the entire game, all across the league. And what it does is it creates a lot of natural rubs. You run out the backside of the defense and rely heavily on the yards after the catch, and it's exactly how they're able to pick up this big game. On first and 10, here's Pacheco. And he'll manage to get this ahead for a pickup of five. Mahomes now to throw on second down. And that's a first down. It will be a gain of eight. A give here to Pacheco. And he'll plow forward for a gain of four yards. Here's a second and six. Mahomes, back. He'll get this complete to Pacheco. And that's a first down. It will be a gain of eight. Nice pick up here to the back. And what really stands out about this drive is the ability of the quarterback to really spread the ball around to multiple targets and put so much pressure on the defense, deciding who do they want to account for because no matter who they try to take away, quarterback's doing a nice job of finding the open man. On second down, Mahomes. On throw here, right side, falls incomplete. Travis Kelsey, the intended target. Now it's going to be third down. To throw is Mahomes. He'll get this out to his running back. Second time they've hooked up on this drive. This one good for 12 and a first down. get him down this time not as easy as the last carry this time they drop him behind the line of scrimmage second down throwing from the gun here's Patrick off he goes just getting anything out of that one I think is impossible it looked like he might have to throw it away early instead he pulls it down he winds up picking up a yard. Mahomes going to throw here on third down. That's going to be incomplete, and the clock will stop. Likely one more play in this third quarter. Oh, he missed it from short range. A bad miss. It's no good. And they'll remain out front by one. The drive begins at the 20. Here's first and 10. On the ground, it's Cook to start this drive. And he'll be brought down. Oh. They'll come up here on second down and five. From the gun to Dallas. 
And they'll get him down after a gain of five, but that is enough for a first down. Well, we'll give a little credit here defensively. Even though they allow the first down, we've seen defenses really struggle bringing this big tight end to the ground, and they didn't allow him to pick up a bunch of yards after contact, but he was able to get just enough to pick up the first down. So, first and ten now from the 30. They'll keep it on the ground. And he finds some daylight up past the 35-yard line. A pickup of seven. Here's a second and three forthcoming. They'll go play action here with Allen. Oh, he's going to be bottled up and taken down. They got him. George Karlaftis, the former Boilermaker, in there for the sack. Sometimes you just have to know when the play is over and live to play another down. He has pressure coming right at him. And instead of just throwing the ball away, he tries to escape, he tries to get creative, and he ends up losing a lot more yards than he should have. I think the biggest issue and why they find themselves trailing in this game, Mike, has really just been the ups and downs of this passing game. And sometimes he's highly accurate and efficient, but at others, he just misses too many easy throws. The question is, are they going to be able to overcome this quarterback inconsistency and pull this game out? And he's going to be brought down after a short return. And that's where his team will get possession of the football. A fresh set of downs to work with. It is first down and 10. Here's Mahomes. into the end zone 75 yards touchdown Kansas City the extra point by Butker is good and the Chiefs extend the lead to 8 it's 21 to 13 So now it's Butker following the touchdown to send this one away. This one is fielded in the end zone, but he decides not to bring it out. So they'll take over at the 30-yard line. down a pass caught right side by Coleman and that keeps him ahead of schedule that's a first down completion of seven yards now Allen and he'll be taken down as the clock ticks towards two minutes to play Two minutes remain in the fourth quarter. Greg and I back on EA Sports after this. Plenty of time. All three timeouts left. It's first and ten. They'll drop to throw. And a good effort there defensively. It's knocked away and incomplete. All right, so this is why you get paid the big bucks. These are the possessions as a quarterback you need to deliver for your team. Everybody talks about two-minute. Everybody drills it every single week. But when it comes down to this moment in the game, your quarterback needs to be on point. And after that first down incompletion, it just... And he will go all the way. Curtis Samuel. Touchdown, Bills. 
What a finish there to get the touchdown, but of course the job's not done, and this is where the defense needs to regroup, Mike. It's one thing to give up the touchdown, but now you're still one stop away from being the hero. They got to dial in, get their best defense called, and somehow find a way to keep them out of the end zone. Out of the gun, here's Allen. And he is going to get into the end zone. The two-point conversion works, and we've got ourselves a tie game. Tie game. Still time to break that tie, though, as you see. Maybe run a two-minute offense. And the kick's in the air. This kick is fielded in the end zone, but no move to bring it out. It's touchback, and that ball will come out to the 30-yard line. Here's Pacheco, and he'll get back maybe to the line of scrimmage, but probably going to be a loss of a yard here. Well, they try to get the run game started here early on this drive, Mike, and they're just going to have to do a better job up front. There's really nowhere for this ball carrier to go. You never want to lose yards on first down, but that's exactly the case here. A throw on the move is caught. Here's first and ten. From the shotgun, it's Mahomes. He'll be hit as he throws, and that one will wind up incomplete. Could not step into the throw that time. It'll bring up second down. A run with Pacheco. He'll be stacked up at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play. Now, a big third down. Now, Mahomes. That's complete. Who else? It's Kelsey. Wow, out of bounds. Inside the 10. It's first and goal. It's a big play when they needed it the most. A gain of 48. Here's Pacheco. And he's going to lose yardage. How about the defense standing up in the red zone? They'll mark it at the 10. Second and goal. One more time with Pacheco. And he gets this one down inside the 10, but it will set up third and goal. A lot riding on this play. High game. Final minute, third down. They'll run with Pacheco. Some determined running, but they're going to stop him short of the goal line. Well, this sets up a big call here, Mike, on fourth down. You find yourself in a tie ball game with the ball. Do you decide to keep your offense on the field and try to play for six, or are you content coming off the field, taking the lead by three? We'll see what this coach decides. Big moment for a guy who's made some big kicks in his career, Harrison Butker. This a potential game winner. This kick is good. And that very likely will be a game winner. And that's just got to be a great feeling over on that sideline, Mike. I mean, an excellent job by this offense to give yourself a chance to win it. And then this kick. I mean, what's left to be said? It was never in doubt, and it's going to lead this team to a victory. The return team going to let that one go. It'll go through the end zone. It's a touchback. This is first and ten. A final shot now for Allen. And that's going to be incomplete. The defense holds here in the final minute. And they're going to get out of here with a victory.